CBS 2 News starts right now with breaking news. A bombshell from the Chicago Police Department. The acting superintendent is asking the state's attorney's office to drop charges against a man shot by a police officer two days ago. CBS 2's Mike Puccinelli joins us live now from outside Chicago Police Headquarters with the story. Mike, Ariel Roman was initially facing drug charges and resisting arrest. That's right, Jim, but earlier today, the state's attorney's office did indeed drop those charges, that coming at the request of interim police superintendent Charlie Beck, who said he just thought it would be insensitive at this time to press forward with those charges amid a significant level of concern surrounding the arrest and shooting. A Chicago police officer struggling with Ariel Roman yells for him to stop resisting. Stop! Stop resisting! It's something he screams more than 10 times, but all the while, the struggle continues for more than four minutes. That as CTA passengers walk by and up an escalator, apparently with little interest. In other angles, you can hear the taser deployed seemingly with little effect. Then Roman is pepper sprayed right in his face, and it still fails to stop him from struggling. That's when the male officer who has been wrestling with Roman can be heard urging his female partner to shoot. Seconds later, she draws her weapon, and when Roman walks away from the wall while rubbing his face, a first shot rings out. Then both officers pursue him up the escalator stairs when another shot is heard. Now, the struggle broke out Friday after officers attempted to detain Roman for walking between cars while the train was moving. Roman is still recovering in the hospital this evening. As for the officers, they are both on desk duty pending the outcome of this investigation. Reporting live outside police headquarters, Mike Puccinelli, CBS 2 News. Jim. Mike, thank you.